Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. So I'm back home now. You guys know I went to my boyfriend's cottage for like five days, four nights. It was a lovely time. I love it up north so much. It makes me so happy and I just, I like being away from the city way more. Also, my skin has cleared tremendously since I was gone. Let me just say, we are smooth, ladies and gentlemen. But anyways, I did shoot some like little montage clips on my phone from when I was up north, so I'm gonna include those now. happy to be back home but I also like am dying to go back to the cottage because it was so much fun and I loved it so much but now I'm just going to freshen myself up a bit I need to like wash my hair and style it really badly I, I was kind of gifted the Dyson blow dryer and also their Corral straightener which I have been obsessed with I've been using them for like weeks now since I was gifted them and they're the best things ever so I'm gonna style my hair with those and show you guys it because it's like the MVP for straightening and curling my hair I am obsessed obsessed literally the best thing i've ever used but anyways i'm gonna go to my bed now i need to like really clean my room it's like a disaster and i'm gonna shower and then we will catch up after that okay guys i'm gonna take a shower now i thought i'll show you the shampoo and conditioner we use i really like the function of beauty one but i don't have it here it's at my place still i haven't moved it over so i've just been using the l'oreal dream lights this is almost out this is the shampoo literally running on this much <laughs> so shampoo and then for conditioner i just use a hair mask i'm really good at filming hi i'm like not even in the shot whoa i did not put the lid on i just use this hair mask for my conditioner so it's the l'oreal dream lengths savior mask for long damaged hair which i mean my hair is still pretty split endy no matter what i do so i use this as my conditioner and i'm gonna shower now yay my hair needs a wash okay it probably still smells like a lake okay i am out of the shower i put on some light makeup i'm just gonna brush through this freaking rat's nest i always use like a wide tooth comb like this one when my hair is wet to just reduce breakage because your hair is the most fragile when it's wet and we don't want any breakage once i brush in my hair i'm just gonna apply some oil and that's all I do before I blow dry and style it yay oh do you see that Ugh. big knot look at the brush side versus the non brush side okay oh great here and eat some lunch it's like almost two in the afternoon and i'm starving the go-to green smoothie just blesses my soul so good i'm gonna eat this and we're gonna carry on with my hair <laughs> okay guys i just finished blow drying my hair obviously i used the dyson supersonic blow dryer best thing ever hair is blow dried yay now i'm gonna curl it Woo! <laughs> okay let me just let me just plug in my curler once I... Now, I might not even need this plug depending on how charged this puppy is. You're fully charged. Alrighty then. We are good to go. Today, I'm going to curl my hair with a straightener. This is the Dyson Corral straightener. This thing is the bomb.com. One of my favorite things about it, chargeable, okay? So you can use it not plugged in, which is actually the best thing ever because wires are just so annoying. You end up like choking yourself out with them. It's just not ideal, you know? So this is the best. Love it. Oh, and look at that. It's already at temperature. 
that fast, ladies and gentlemen, that fast. So the Dyson is one of the only straighteners that has a flexing plate technology, which means that it is designed to flex with your hair as you do it instead of against your hair, which makes it a lot smoother and helps prevent damage, which we all want. So the Dyson basically comes with three heat settings. So it has the 210, 185, and 165. So I like to do the middle setting, which is 185 degrees Celsius. That's what I do for my hair. That's all I need. I don't feel like I need to go up to the higher setting in order to get the curls that I want or the straightness that I want. So I just don't do that, but I'm going to curl it. So basically all you do is clamp and I like to twist like almost 360 degrees and then you just pull through and it creates curls like this. I used to always curl my hair with a straightener when I was in high school and I loved it because it was super fast and I also like that you only have to bring like one tool with you instead of bringing a curler and a straightener. Dyson knows. They know what they're doing, okay? They know what they're doing. <laughs> It's all curled and waved. It looks so pretty and bouncy and it still has all of its like shine to it which is really nice and yeah I'm really happy with how it turned out. So definitely definitely a fan of Dyson products. They know what they're doing and thank you again to Dyson for gifting me this beautiful creation. I'm obsessed guys i finally changed out of my pajamas so i'm just wearing this little romper it's from fortune one this is like my favorite romper that i own i literally wear it all the time because i'm obsessed with it it's my favorite thing literally ever so wearing that my hair has the curls have fallen out a bit so they look a lot more natural now which is what i like to go for but they're still like super bouncy which i like and yeah, me and my mom are gonna go walk the dogs now and then we might go check out Home Sense because I haven't been there in so long and hopefully there won't be like long lines or anything so we can just go in, have a little ganda and come back out. We will see how that goes. But right now we're just gonna walk the dogs. Apparently it's really nice out so I am excited to be outside in the sunshine. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Mm. All right, hello. <laughs> Mom, look, you're in the shot too. Yay. <laughs> we are going to Homestead. Are we going there first or are we going to the garden? Gardens. We're going to the garden center first. Then we should go to Starbucks. Then we should go to Homestead. Yeah, we're going to the garden center. I don't know what, what do you want to look at at the garden center? Some plants, flowers, if they have any left. So yeah, we're gonna do that, and then we're gonna go to Home Sense and whatnot. It's a beautiful day. There is not a cloud in the sky right now, and it's just lovely. I'm in a great mood because the sun's out, so that's always good. And yeah, now look at my lovely hair. Yeah, my mom is not gonna be able to get her hair done until August or September, so your face would be brunette. But <laughs> brunette with gray. You sure you don't want this for the front of the house? No? no. <laughs> Alright. I kind of like it. <laughs> Baby bears. That's cute. Oh, a spaniel. Oh, of course you like those. Oh, turtles. Okay, home sounds ready. <laughs> <laughs> My mom looks <laughs> funny. We haven't been here in like so long. So long. So here we go. Let's see if they even have stuff in stock, shall we? It's like empty. We have one planter. <laughs> Holy shit, it's so weird. Brush your product coming soon. You know why? Probably just because, remember what Lori said? That they had to like sell out a bunch of their stuff to get new it stuff? It was literally a ghost town. There was nothing, okay? Like the store was basically empty. Crazy. Crazy, crazy. They said that apparently like every time they get new stock, it sells out in like 24 hours. People go crazy and they just buy everything. <laughs> literally, it's insanity. 
and I'm so used to home tents being full of stuff and everything is empty. And they said it's probably gonna take months for the store to be like full again, which is just craziness, like literally crazy. This is my first shopping post. <laughs> well, not post, during COVID still, but like COVID shopping experience. And I'm like, oh my God, there's nothing. I guess I'm gonna have to shop online for everything for my house <laughs> because Home says will not be delivering. <laughs> they don't got they don't got the goods, okay? They're empty. Wow, it's crazy. It's really sad. Poor Kaya's got a weird mole thing on her lip. Oh my god, it looks so big now. So we're going to get that looked at on Friday. She doesn't want to show it on camera, but she's she's shy. She's embarrassed of her mole. It's okay, Kaya. I have moles too. Don't worry, we're in the same boat. <laughs> it's both of us. It's both of us with the weird moles. But yeah, we're gonna take her because it literally came out of nowhere and it's kind of concerning. So we're taking her to the vet on Friday to find out what it is. What is it? What is it? Huh? What is it? I just ordered myself some freshy. Whoa, my, my voice just disappeared there. <laughs> some freshy. <laughs> and I'm gonna start editing a bit of this vlog now. And yeah, this is my day so far. Not very eventful. Not very eventful, but. You just got home. I just got home. Before you shake it up and after. Yummy. In my tummy. <laughs> Alright guys, I think I'm just going to end off this vlog here. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. Give it a thumbs up if you did. And you love dogs because my dogs are barking right now. <laughs> and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye!